This video is going to introduce the DotWorks D2 HB solar version. This version of DotWorks D2 housing enables remote solar powered solutions to come directly into the housing and power the camera and other vital system components. So unlike our NVP technology, this solar version that it's, is built specifically for that 12 volt input that 12 volt input then has been stepped down to work with the different camera voltages, but also um, we have put in a very specific and very uh, focused heating system as opposed to our, our bigger, more robust de-icing systems. So the smaller, lower wattage heating solution and the smaller fan combined make up a, a much less of a draw uh, for, the, for those types of applications. It just provides more avenues and, and more ability to get the D2 housing, the cameras and other vital components out in remote locations working as a complete system. So some of the features of the solar version D2 is that of course as I explained the the lower wattage heating element that is is focused around the lower lens um, other other features do include the thermal blanket with radiant barrier insulative system on the inside that reduces uh, of course solar loading uh, throughout the day but also uh, retains heat throughout some of the colder nighttime temperatures so when we're dealing with this lower wattage heating we've just actually just made it a little bit more efficient on the inside and that gives us some some ability to of course stabilize the internal temperatures but at the same time allows uh, for us to protect the uh, the cameras and the other components are going that are going to go into this uh, system um, for a much broader range of uh, extreme temperatures both high and low. Features on the inside of this housing do include of course the ability to mount cameras from the bottom up or from the top down as with all of our D2 and D2, D3 housing systems but also so that we can accommodate those smaller cameras uh, like small mini domes and of course uh, standard size PTZs and larger size PTZs. Uh, other features include our universal uh, mounting tray on the inside so that uh, uh, some of our newer uh, Zero or, or NVR systems can be mounted inside the housing. Um, that's also a very nice piece uh, as well as wireless devices such as the 3G, 4G routers uh, and of course some of the, the, the name brand products uh, from like say FireTide and Proxim and, and of course Fluid Mesh and, and some of the others that are on the market um, so that they can mount directly and safely inside the housing for these types of applications. Accessories that we recommend for the D2 HB solar version would of course include our standard pole mount adapter but we also have an extended pole mount adapter system that is a little bit larger um, but it is as well a, a pole mount uh, adaption system but it does have room for, for other components to potentially be put in between the D2 and the pole system where it's going to be attaching to. So this is a very popular item uh, for uh, of course mounting antennas uh, uh, mounting uh, um, other products that uh, may be uh, required of the remote powering system that you're, you're engaging in into, this, uh, into your projects. Of course we have a light kit system for mounting lights or antennas on the top of the D2. This is just a handy way to be able to put lights, uh, of course either flashing or, uh, or, or always on, um, but also for omnidirectional antennas if you want to make it all one piece installation. That's very handy for, of course, uh, long term maintenance and, and uh, of course, field deployments.